In this video, you'll learn the six steps to become an inclusive leader and the three behaviors you must demonstrate. Leaders who create an inclusive culture for their teams see performance increased by 17%, decision-making quality boosted by 20%, and collaboration enhanced by 29%. Teams of inclusive leaders perform better. While more and more leaders are aware of the benefits of having a diverse and inclusive culture, many don't know how to be an inclusive leader. As a speaker on generational workplace diversity, I experienced firsthand the challenges leaders have grasping inclusive leadership. In my recent video, Six Reasons to Be an Inclusive Leader, I highlight growing trends that are driving the need for inclusive leadership. Inclusion is a new capability that leaders must fold in to their other timeless leadership capabilities, such as influencing, effective communication, vision casting, team building, etc. Inclusive leaders not only embrace value and provide a sense of belonging to individuals, but they leverage individual differences as a competitive advantage. In order for leaders to equip themselves with an inclusive capability, there are six questions that must be answered with a virtuous and resounding yes. Here are six steps to become an inclusive leader. Number one, belief. Do you wholeheartedly believe everyone is created equal? Number two, awareness. Are you aware of the conscious and unconscious biases? Number three, boldness. Are you honest with others about your shortcomings or misperceptions? Number four is curiosity. Are you open to unlearning and relearning from others? Number five, action. Are your behaviors and actions towards others aligned with your belief of equality? And number six, commitment. Do you consistently hold yourself and others accountable to a culture of inclusion? Inclusive behavior trumps inclusive programs. 69% of workers value working for an organization that demonstrates inclusive behaviors, but inconsistent inclusion programs, as opposed to high quality inclusion programming, but inconsistent inclusive behaviors. In order to create and sustain a culture of inclusion, leaders must behave inclusively. More specifically, employees feel included at work when they are treated fairly, appreciated for uniqueness, provided a sense of belonging, and given decision-making voice. As a result, inclusive leaders should demonstrate these three daily behaviors. Number one, treat every individual and group fairly. Number two, understand and value the uniqueness of individuals while including them as members of the group. And number three, tap into cognitive diversity for enhanced decision-making and risk reduction. Leaders who embrace diversity and inclusion will find themselves properly equipped to thrive in today's increasingly diverse 21st century workplace and marketplace.